the Alan gates open and they're in racing for the Artesia Cup missing the kick by about three lengths in the start there was Copernicus but as they sort themselves out, and it's Mr. Gorgeous in the gold and red jacket with the gold cap, the leader, by about a length and a half in front of Eversham is in second place. A length away, Eversham is no more politics. A length and a half away, no more politics. Bringing up the rear is Copernicus. They go well past the 1100 meter marker and approach the 1000. It's Mr. Gorgeous, the leader, by about two lengths in front of Eversham is in second place. A length away, Eversham, there's no more politics. A length and a half to two lengths away is Copernicus. They pass in the 800 meter pole and it's Mr. Gorgeous by about a length in front of Eversham tracking him all the time in second place. Not too far away, there's no more politics. A gap of two lengths away, no more politics. As they go well past the 600 meter pole, there's Copernicus bringing up the rear as they start to negotiate the turn and straighten up for the final run in. Round the turn into the straight, Mr. Gorgeous comes in on first. Barbara Lent in front of Eversham is the one on the outside. A length and a half, two lengths away, there's Copernicus, then comes no more politics. But Mr. Gorgeous now being pressurized on the outside there by Eversham. Another two and a half lengths away, there comes Copernicus. But it's Eversham who puts his head in front. Is about a length in front of Mr. Gorgeous and is running away with the Artesia Cup. It's all over. Eversham wins this one from Mr. Gorgeous, then came uh, No More Politics, last four was Copernicus.